when you do a new installation of WordPress it will automatically install some sample data and plugins and some other bits and pieces which are designed to show you exactly what WordPress can do and if you're using WordPress for the first time then this is really useful but when you want to start using WordPress in earnest frankly they just get in the way and take up space and server capacity and so you really need to get rid of them and in this video I'm going to show you how to do that how to clean up WordPress and get it ready to start being used in earnest okay first thing you'll notice when you log on to the dashboard is it says right now you've got one post one page one category one comment so we need to delete all of these you'll find here there's a recent comment here from mr. WordPress well what we want to do is first of all click here to put that in the trash and that's gone and then when we come over to posts you will see there's a post there that says hello world you want to send that to the trash so click there put that into the trash and then click here on the link that says trash and then click on this little link here that says delete permanently and there we are it's gone the next thing you want to get rid of are the links that WordPress puts in if I click here on links you'll see there's a whole load of links that link back to wordpress.org sites and all this does is build wordpress.org's link popularity it doesn't do you any favors at all so click here up in this top little checkbox which checks all of these and then where it says bulk actions select delete and then click on apply and that's got rid of all that let's go back to the dashboard because you can see it has one page and one category now on the one page if we click there you'll see it says a sample page and this again is something that you do not need so we'll click here on trash and then click on the trash icon to get rid of it again select and you can either delete permanently or select the tick mark and then delete permanently from the drop down menu and we'll click on apply and there we go that is now gone let me come to plugins and WordPress adds a plugin that you really do not need and that is hello dolly so we want to get rid of that and then click on yes delete these files the Askimet uh, or Akismet however you care to pronounce it plugin is something that you probably will need so it's best to leave that and there we go that's pretty much it we go back to dashboard you also find here there's one category that is automatically set up and that is uncategorized now you cannot delete this unless you already have another category in there uh, personally I would leave this anyway because sometimes when you've got new categories in there there are some that aren't going to fit so it's probably best to leave that one as it is let's go back to dashboard and there we go now your WordPress blog is ready to be used and you're ready to start putting all of your 
uh, data in there as well.